All right, welcome back. We're going to make another video. This one's going to be on the uh, TP-Link Mesh Wi-Fi Extender. Model number AC1900. And it is a dual band. Dual band is 5 gigahertz or 2.4 gigahertz. 5 gigahertz is at 1300 megabits a second. And uh, 2.4 is at 600. Okay, this is considered a... Wi-Fi dead zone killer, uninterrupted streaming, three times three MU dash MIMO. I have no idea what that means. It also has a uh, gigabit Ethernet port on the side, as you can see on the box. It says it's an easy setup with the Tether app, which you'll download in the Play Store or the App Store for Apple. Okay, and it says works with any Wi-Fi router, which is very important because some Wi-Fi extenders I have read do not support all routers. And it's RE550, whatever that is. Now, it does got information, you know, on the back of the box. Tells you a bit more about it on the side of the box. On the back of the box, it also has uh, a bunch of information and also on this other side. Now, this was uh, recommended by a friend of mine. Um, and I like the TP-Link brand as it is because in my computer, I have the uh, wireless, uh, what do you call that, 82.11. I got their little wireless adapter inside my computer. I've had it for about 10 years. It works perfectly fine. I have no issues with it. The reason why I bought this thing I have Frontier for my internet provider. Now, out here in my garage, however, okay, I have a TV out here. So when I'm working on the cars and if I want to listen to music or watch TV, unfortunately, I get no uh, internet connection because the router is approximately, I'm going to say, at least 75 feet from where my TV sits to the router inside the living room over there and if you look over here here is the uh, adapter itself you know it's got three antennas it's got your power button it's got three indicators one for the 2.4 then the 5 and then the indicator for the power so when it's all blue you know it's working and on the side over here you know that's where you can plug in your your cable all right uh, like I said, I bought this one. Uh, let's see, because of my, you know, my Frontier Internet, I cannot get Internet out here. It doesn't reach far enough, which I'm surprised because Frontier has far better Internet service than Spectrum does. With Spectrum, there was a lot of spotty service inside the house. But if I came out here to the garage, I can turn on my TV or watch Wi-Fi on my phone, and I had zero issues connected. So, but with Frontier, the internet service in the house is absolutely fantastic. There's no interruptions. Uh, you know, say when my grandson is playing on his PlayStation 5, if I'm on a computer and the wife is watching TV, there's absolutely no interruptions whatsoever. We get exactly what we were told we were going to get. So when I called them and I asked them about this, they said, well, we can send you the uh, one of our extenders that would cost you $10 a month. Now, why would I spend $10 a month when I went on Amazon? I, I picked this up for under, for under $40, so it's one and done. I bought it, paid for it. I don't have to pay no fee for it, okay? So I'm not going to be out in my garage every single day watching TV or, or working on my cars or anything like that. So, you know, why do I want to pay them $10 a month? You know, to me, that's completely ridiculous. So that's why I picked up this this little adapter over here, and it and it uh, it runs perfectly fine. I've had absolutely no issues with it. When you're done uh, plugging it in, what you'll do is you'll go into, like I said, the uh, Google Play or the Apple App Store. You'll download the Tether app to your phone. You'll set it up. You'll create an account. And once that's all set up, you'll choose a password for your extender. And then what you'll do is you'll go into your settings 
inside the app and you'll connect to your router wherever your router may be and then when you're done with all that stuff there you just go into your settings on your phone I mean uh, not I'm, I'm sorry on your computer I'll show you real quick all right just go down to your settings down here go to network go to check connection or even set up connection wireless all right it's it's scanning for wireless networks naturally and then there you go Gumby extended that's what I call the Gumby extended because that's also the name of the uh, router it's just Gumby <laughs> that's just a nickname I gave my daughter years ago and then bingo there you have it my signal strength is uh, absolutely excellent so you know here now let me show you we'll go down to YouTube Well, there you go. I'm back to my YouTube channel. I can just go ahead and click on any video I want to watch. There's absolutely no issues whatsoever. There's no uh, no buffering, no nothing. It, it's fantastic. So if you're looking for a uh, Wi-Fi extender, now of course you can use them in your house naturally. If you got a uh, two stories like I have and you're having issues, sure you can use it. In the house as well naturally but I'm using mine out in the garage like I said it's a fantastic product if you need one check it out I got it on amazon.com or you could probably pick it up at Best Buy or Walmart I think uh, Best Buy has it but it was uh, more expensive at Best Buy so I got it at Amazon have a great day folks